What's going on Genji Gamers? Sam here, back at it again for another video. And in today's video, Hoyo just released their 3.6 drip marketing, and I wanted to talk about the revealed characters. So let's get into it. Now let's start off with Baiju. My word, this little portrait art looks awesome. I've always thought Baiju's in-game design looks fantastic. Let's see if, I wonder if they'll do a little bit of tweaking to it. But I'm pretty sure Baiju will be the five star of the patch. He just kind of screams five star. I mean, we've known about Baiju for, you know, pretty much since the start of Genshin. I mean, since we got to Liyue, we were introduced to him as the owner of the Bubu Pharmacy. He kind of keeps Chi Chi in check. And all in all, I've, I've always really liked his VA too. He sounds like very kind of smart and witty, and I'm just really keen to, to see what he does. Obviously, we know he's a Dendro character, and as mentioned, I presume he'll be the five-star character. As far as what he'll do, I, I have no idea. I mean... I always thought Baiju was going to be a five-star Dendro sword user, but we just got all hate them, so I don't really envision that. So other than that, he screams like he could be a character in Hogwarts Legacy. So, I mean, technically he could be like a Catalyst user. Maybe he's got like some cool magical abilities. Maybe he has a follow-up attack with his little snake, Chang Shen, who honestly is pretty cool as well. Chang Shen has their own voice actor, which is actually pretty cool. Yeah, so I, I don't know exactly what he's going to do. I mean, to me, being the owner of the Boomu Pharmacy, that kind of screams, you know, being a healer. Like, what do you do at a pharmacy? You get medicine that keeps you healthy, heals you, etc. I guess technically he could also be like a shielder as well. Like, you know, you go to the pharmacy to get preventi prevent preventative wow, medicine. So maybe he's a blend of a healer and a shielder i have no idea i mean we did just get meow yao who's actually a pretty good dendro healer so i don't know i don't know what baiju is going to do but i i do know that he's probably going to be pretty strong because he is from leo way and hoyo has a propensity to make leo way characters honestly really good so i'm really excited to see what he does moving over to kave so kave and i hope i said that right is um more than likely gonna be a four star character i mean his his design looks pretty sweet as well you know he is introduced as all hate them's roommate so my guess for him is that you know he could probably be dendros you know goru kujosara shenha because genshin is really you know kind of invested into making these support characters that support one specific element so if i was guessing I kind of think that's what uh, Kave will be, but it remains to be seen. But uh, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to give my thoughts on these two revealed characters. I think I'm pretty excited for 3.6. I think it could be a really banger patch. I know a lot of people are relatively turned off by 3.5. I mean, the whole Dia debacle with her going to Standard Banner. Obviously, I know a lot of people are perturbed that Mika isn't going to be paired with Eula. So... I'm really curious, are you guys you know, going for 3.5 characters or have you been swayed to go for 3.6 characters after seeing the drip marketing? But uh, I guess we'll just have to see what the four stars are and to see what rerun banners come in 3.6. But I, I think I'm personally really excited for 3.6 and um, that's pretty much it. So I appreciate you guys all so much for watching and let me know in the comments, who are you gonna be pulling for? Who are you excited for in the upcoming banners? Catch you guys later. Peace.